Yeah. Karen, let, let me help you. I'm going to break cover because um, you deserve it. Thank you. Yeah. Duncan and James have already said they have to, they have to make an offer. You've already said you are coming and then looking for an offer from Duncan and James. But I'll be more than happy to underwrite what you asked for, uh, which was 50,000, 15%. So I'm really short the policy. Okay. In a bid to flush out a potential offer from his rival dragon, the Enterprise has shown his hand. But it's not gone down well with Duncan Banatai. I remember Sean, we had a, a, a fantastic lady that came in front of us um, with a retail product. I remember seeing a young lad, you know, it's a fantastic product. And the best person to use about that product is to see pieces and pull it out and left it into the middle of the Yeah. I'll just do these two dragons and we'll do that. I'll go make her an offer. You can do it. She wants you to. Make her an offer. <laughs> it's a bizarre den moment. Will James Khan and Duncan Bannatine come back with a tactic hey, to fox their rivals? <laughs> Thank you, Sharon. Thank you. 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 Thank um, we would like to make an offer for 80,000 um, because to go into America, Australia, uh, and all of that, yeah. um, to do it properly, yeah. you know, I think it's better to have a bit more than to have a bit less, um, but we need 25%. Okay. Can I add anything to that? Uh, no. Sharon now has an offer for more money than she came in for but in return for much more equity. Is Deborah Meaden prepared to take on Sharon's preferred dragon to clinch the deal? Without a doubt, these guys are very well placed, but you shouldn't discount the experience that other people have. Because to be honest, getting those to the overseas market in one area is to getting into a good market in other areas. And we, all of us, have experience yeah. in doing that. And certainly nobody else complains when they work with me. So I will make you an offer, and I'll make you an offer at the level that you want. So 50,000 pounds, 15 percent. If we do work together and find that we needed more money in the business, yeah. I just make the business happen, and I provide the funds to do it, as long as I'm convinced and make it happen. <laughs> It's a show of ruthless determination from Deborah Meaden. Now, Peter Jones is ready to tell Sharon where he stands. I think and feel that you don't need any money. Um, and I think you need an individual or individuals that are going to take this product to help you, take this product and expand.